The Giants and their fans got some bad news Wednesday morning. Defensive end Jason Pierre-Paul having surgery on a sports hernia. He's out at least six weeks. That means his regular season's over. Still, I guess, is a shot that he could return if the Giants progress deep enough in the playoffs, but it's way too early to tell that, and even then, that's a long ways down the road for the Giants. They need to focus on the here and now. They have four games to try to get back to the playoffs. What are they going to do? They have three reserve ends on the roster. Kerry Wynn, the veteran. Romeo Aquara, undrafted rookie out of Notre Dame. And O.O. Digizua, second-year player who was a third-round pick a year ago out of UCLA. I think Wynn, you might see him be the starter, the guy in there for the first snap against the Cowboys on Sunday night. He's a plus run defender. He's a veteran. He's got experience. But if you look at the snap counts this year, when Okwara has been healthy, he's been healthy the whole season. Wynn had missed two games with a concussion. Oh, did you miss last week's game with a knee injury? He's hopeful he will practice Wednesday. But if you look at those snap counts, Okwara and Odigizu have most of the time played more snaps than Wynn in a game. So I think you're going to see mostly Okwara and Odigizu kind of rotate in and out. They've kind of bounced back and forth although Okora has kind of established himself as the third end. Not that the Giants really used a third end or a fourth end that much because as we've all talked about, JPP and OV playing tremendously high snap counts and you know people are going to wonder is that the reason why JPP is now going to miss the rest of the regular season because he was playing so many snap counts did he break down, was there a durability issue? That's another subject for another time. The Giants have to focus on a task at hand. They're playing the Dallas Cowboys, the best offensive line in the NFL and they're without one of their two star pass rushes. I, I wrote this on NJ.com. Vernon and JPP have combined for 15 sacks this season. The three Giants currently on the active roster to play defensive end have combined for two in their career. They've got a third sack on the practice squad with Stansley Maponga. They also signed ex-Jet Jordan Williams to the practice squad on Tuesday, but that's just a depth thing. I wouldn't expect the Giants to make a roster move, as I said. If JPP could potentially be back for the NFC title game or the Super Bowl, I expect them to keep him on the active roster for now. But look, Giants have their hands full. They've got a big void they're going to have to have someone step into. Probably can't just be one player. Probably going to be a combination of Win, Okwar, and Odigizu. This is a big shot for Okwara, and especially for Odigizua. Once he gets healthy, he's hopeful that he'll be ready to go this week. And for Wynn as well. You know, Wynn's going to be a free agent coming in this year. He's going to be restricted, so he has a chance to earn himself some money as well. Look, this is a really bad blow for the Giants, but it's one they're going to have to try to weather if they want to make the playoffs. Next man has to step up. Ben McAdoo always says that. Now let's see if they can.